Hey everyone, and thanks for tuning in today. I've created these videos to supplement blog posts on the Tech Journal, my personal technology blog at stephenwagner.com. If you haven't already seen it, make sure you check it out. I cover a wide variety of content from compute, storage, virtualization, and more. If you want to hire me and my company to help you out with anything you've seen in the videos or for your corporate IT needs, please head over to Hire Stephen Wagner on the blog, or you can go to my corporate website at www.digitallyaccurate.com. Today, I want to talk to you about a new tool that was recently released about a week ago from Hewlett Packard Enterprise. This is the HPE MSA Health Check. The MSA Health Check helps you check your MSA's current health status, and it's compatible with the 1040, 1050, 2040 and variant, 2050 and variant, and P2000 G3 SAN and SAS arrays. How do you use it? You just download the log files off your MSA SAN or SAS array, log into the web-based interface, upload the log files, and the tool will generate a report that you can use to gain some insight into your MSA array. So to give you a little demo of this, I'm gonna load it up with my own MSA 2040 array, and I'm gonna show you exactly how to use the tool. First things first, what you're gonna to wanna to do is log into your MSA storage array. After logging in, on the lower left-hand side of the screen, you're gonna click on the arrow and choose save logs. Some of you might be familiar with this as this is the typical process that you go through when you're submitting log files to HPE support engineers. There's two fields that are mandatory and required and after filling these in you're going to hit OK and it's going to start generating the files. I'm going to speed this up at this point so that we don't have to wait and we'll take it to the point where the log files are available for download. You'll notice that the browser downloads the files to the download directory You'll go over to the MSA Health Check tool. You'll click on Upload MSA Log Files. You're going to select the log files that we just generated. At this point, it is now securely uploading the log files to HPE servers. Depending on your internet connection, this could be fairly fast or some will take a little bit of time. And we are good to go. At this point, the web page will reload and it'll present you with the current health state of your MSA array. You'll notice that there's a whole bunch of different metrics that are checked. You can see more information on the test by selecting see test descriptions. It's an extensive list. We won't be going into detail with it with this video. You also have the ability to export to PDF files so that you can present the report to others. I hope this video has helped. Make sure you check it out, even if your array is healthy, as it's a good tool to have. I hope you enjoyed the video. Have yourself a great day.